The biggest mistake we make as drivers is getting into our cars without doing any checks. This can be disastrous for us because we could go to start the engine and the car spontaneously explodes. Or we get into the car and there's a large snake at the yeah. back. Hey, 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 I'm a snake. Then the car spontaneously explodes. So to avoid a spontaneously exploding car and run on snakes, here are a few pre-driving checks you can use every morning to check your car before setting off. Step 1. Check if the car is actually yours. I know it may sound silly, but how many times have we stepped out of our houses and straight into another man's car? What? No, that doesn't happen. Quite often, yes. No! Make sure it's your car. And in this case, it's a Daihatsu mirror. No! Yes! Your car is small enough to be dissolved in a glass of water. Step 2. Do a visual inspection of your car. Make sure your tin box car is still in the same condition you left it last night. Check the paint. The windows. The trims. The lights. and even the tires. Is everything good? Yes. You sure? Yeah. What's that over there? Is that your number plate missing? Oh, whoa, whoa. Yeah, my number plate is missing. You see, if you set out without looking at your plates, you'd have been driving without number plates. Then you'd look much more like a tool. Right, we get it. What? I'm just saying. Step 3. Check the interior of the car and make sure there's no random stuff. Alright, get inside your car and have a good look at it. Yes, that's all you can afford. That's it. Just a bare basic interior because you didn't work hard enough. Jeez! It looks like a four-year-old child put it together. Why are you so mean? Anyway, make sure your windows work. Your radio can turn on. Your air conditioning isn't an alcoholic coughing into your face. <coughs> your seats can adjust and safety belt can lock in place. Also, make sure the snake from Alia isn't inside the car. Huh? Hey. Ah! Can I help you? That's a sassy snake. Better call KWS immediately. Step 4. Check your fluids. Once there, check if your engine yeah. is there. Check if your gearbox yeah. is on the right level. Check your engine Quote. is full in the radiator. Okay, why are you saying it that way? Why? Why do you look that way? All right, I come in peace. Check for any loose hoses, torn belts, or cut electrical wires. You don't want to drive around with a leaking, noisy, and faulty car. Now that you've checked for everything, carefully turn on your engine. Yes! Oh wow! Yeah! Oh, it turned on! Wow. I honestly thought the other bomb would go off. Wait, what? Now that you're still alive and your car is all checked up, you can now drive off to work or whichever place a driver owning a Daihatsu mirror goes. That's it! Bye! Is my car going to explode? The next time you walk to your car in the morning, remember to do all the pre-driving checks. Safe journey, everyone.